Hello, everyone. This is Alan Fine. I am here with uh, Adam Sandler, CEO <laughs> of Perillo Tours. Oh, no, I'm wrong. I'm sorry. Uh, actually, I'm here with Close. yeah. I'm here with Steve Perillo, who is the CEO of Perillo Tours, and we are at USTOA in Orlando, and this is Insider Travel Report. It was great to have Terry Dale show that video. It was really great. I was surprised he uh, did it. Because uh, what I love is it makes sure that everyone here knows yeah. that you are that famous. Uh, well, we'll see. Um, yeah, it's uh, great to be uh, parodied on Saturday Night Live. And it was uh, a great. Perillo commercial. We always say, see your travel agent. He didn't mention that. And he did a little spoof on it. You can great promotional see tour. It. Yeah, 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 it is. Anyway, so uh, Perillo Tours is going to hit 75 years next year, yeah. and so what's new? What's happening? How do you keep yourself so so young? You look so young at 75. Still uh, Italy. You know, my grandfather did this in 1945. You know, we were a travel agency for the first uh, 40 years. Then my father turned to wholesale, and we started working with travel agents. And uh, we've been doing Italy the whole time. And then we go in and out of other destinations. Uh, we have a big following of uh, consumers and travel agents who want to go to new places. Uh, but the Italy thing, I can't. Uh, we gotta, we got to keep after that. And you can always improve. You can always improve, even though a lot of tour companies do Italy, uh, cruise companies. Uh, you do it so well, but it's not all you do. Uh, no, uh, for instance, uh, this year, 2020, we have a Spain, a deluxe Spain tour. Uh, Tell us about it. We're heading into the deluxe market, Perillo Tours, a little bit. Uh, we're slowly, gradually going to higher end. Uh, it's best for us and for the agents. You get a so tell us, what do you, what's the tour comprise of? Uh, Spain is uh, Madrid, Barcelona, Seville, uh, Ronda, uh, all the highlights. And uh, you get deep into the culture, like the olive oil. You know, you go to uh, vineyard tours, wine tasting. They have olive oil tasting tours, which are unbelievable. You don't know anything about uh, olive oil until you take this... Uh, Virgin olive oil, it doesn't mean anything. You've got to know what kind of virgin. It's just a meaningless term. This is what you learn on the thing. Then we do a uh, flamenco show. Flamenco is one of the most passionate uh, entertainments you've ever seen with the guitar playing and the dancing. Castanets. Yeah, yeah. And then, of course, we have a paella cooking class. Really? And paella, yeah. It's not that hard to make. You know, it's rice and seafood, but uh, it's part of the... Techniques. And the hotels are uh, first class and deluxe, and the price points, you know, again around four thousand uh, a person uh, for land, and that's kind of where we are now. Well, you were saying that over over seventy five years, how how it started with uh, the, the 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 accommodations weren't quite what they were, and the food wasn't what it was. Right, right. Uh, well, it was the first time uh, my father was the first one to really go in mass to Italy, and. Uh, it was the value was incredible and uh, the hotel quality they had infrastructure problems in the 60s and 70s Italy uh, uh, and so slowly like a single room we used to have single rooms up until five years ago where you'd get a little cot and a little box shoe box of a room but uh, finally now everyone gets a double room just like the world breakfast is extensive expansive thing uh, the food is better than ever uh, and uh, there's just the demands of the public have uh, increased. But uh, the, the value of a tour is the, the price, because you're sharing it with a group of like-minded people. Uh, so uh, instead of spending uh, 20000 you're going to spend half that on a tour. That's why tours are still valid, and they're, we're growing. You know, the, the tour segment, the coach tour segment in Europe is growing. Again, you know, from the 2009 recession, we've been on an upward uh, incline uh, for these past 10 years. And finally, the baby boomers are coming around. They promised me when I was in my 20s that uh, when the baby boomers uh, retire, they're going to travel like crazy. And I got scared because of the recession, and it was a little scary. I, I, I know a lot of agents experienced the same thing in 2009, 2010, uh, 10, 11, 12. Uh, How are you feeling about uh, 2020? But, uh, 2020 is growing again uh, some more. Uh, 
So, uh, which areas you think are going to be the hottest in 2020? Uh, for us, Italy and the main uh, Rome, Florence, and Venice. Uh, the, the, for second time, third time travelers, you still have the. Uh, you still want to go to places off the beaten track. Most people have not been. Most people don't have a passport in, in the United States. Never mind, have been to Italy. So uh, we talked last time about your FIT site. How's that doing? Oh, it's good. Uh, it's called ItalyVacations.com, uh, and we have a new self-booking engine uh, called the Travel Genie, and uh, you can uh, create your own trip. You don't have to finish it. You can fool around, and then you can call us if you want to uh, want us to help you finalize the trip. Uh, but the best feature of the Travel Genie is we have a library, a template of 25 of the, the best uh, tours that are professionally created over the, you know, from our experience over the years. Uh, so you click it and the whole thing is booked. And then you can go in and edit it. You could change days, hotels, sightseeing, activities. Uh, but it does, you know, the, because a trip is, uh, an average trip is made of 30 elements. You know, you arrive, the transfer to the hotel, the hotel, the sightseeing, getting to the next city, getting from your hotel to the train station to the next hotel. This is all, we, we do this all in a couple of clicks. And it's become, the, the time is, uh, you know. For Saves a lot of time. FITs, yeah, because FIT is, in my grandfather's time, we, uh, we used to use a telex machine. It was really unbelievably. I don't want to think about it time-consuming but now it's uh, phenomenal so for an example um, you don't have to go to Italy to have fun you can go to Hawaii you have any tour you have tours everywhere right so we're not everywhere but uh, Hawaii has been a specialty of ours it's just a couple of programs uh, they're uh, they're fully they're packages with deluxe hotels Hyatt hotels and uh, inter-island airfare meals sightseeing uh, and it's all packaged together in one one easy thing, and it's great for agents, uh, great for consumers. Honeymooners like it because uh, you're not really on a coach tour like in Italy. Uh, you make your own uh, dinner reservations. You're on your own most of the time. But as a package, Hawaii's uh, challenges a lot of elements to to putting it together. So we make it really easy. It's uh, Perillo's Hawaii, a deluxe Hawaii. And, yeah, but going to Hawaii versus going to Hawaii Perillo style, what's the difference? Uh, it's a higher end experience, and uh, it's all inclusive, and uh, we make it affordable. Again, you know. Uh, a couple, you know, not everyone can afford ten thousand dollars, but for what you get for you know a vacation, and it's the last word in uh, this destination. You learn Hawaii when you you're back. You're a, uh, you've really seen it. The three islands or four islands. Uh, and there's no worries. There's no I got to worry about every transfer. I got to worry. It's all taken care of. Yeah, that's the thing about a tour. It's true. It's regimented, but you're free. You don't have to think about the mechanics of the trip. So you can think about. The enjoyment of the trip. Instead of where am I going to go? Or, you know, what time is the train? What time is the flight? What time is this? What am I going to do that? Uh, so it frees you of that. So it's liberating in that way. Traveling with a group is way more fun than you could ever. I mean, you got to tell your uh, your customers that travel. You know, a couple, especially an older couple, traveling for ten days alone. It's it's not the same as meeting new people who are like-minded and uh, and the, the, the way they turn into a family by the it's always it was the third night <laughs> there's always you know dinner and wine and, and a few drinks and then on the way home they're da uh, they're singing on the way home third night it's always true on a Perillo experience uh, they turn into a family and they become friends for life Perillo's tour, Perillo Tours works with travel advisors, and let's since we have so many ninety over ninety eight thousand, yeah. let's talk to them about uh, w how you embrace them, how you work with them. Yeah, uh, we work with travel agents. First of all, co marketing is what we really want. We want to share the expenses 50-50 of any marketing plan you have in your community, any kind of mailing or print advertising or internet, anything, and I do it a lot. It's quite an offer. It really uh, works well. So you get half the money and uh, you're gonna get your name out there, whether you sell us or not, you're gonna get your brand out there. So it's a really uh, good offer. And uh, 
we have the regular commissions and they they ramp up right away uh, 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 yeah twelve percent and then up to fifteen sixteen seventeen depending on how many uh, passengers you book and I know that your uh, partner um, Carol Demopoulos who's president of uh, Perillo Learning Journeys uh, it works very hard to train that she has a program to train travel advisors to better sell the luxury market uh, yeah, you learn. Uh, her main thing is selling groups and how to uh, how to get a group, you know, from a church or a, a, a club or a, a business incentive, and then uh, the different markets. And she's so knowledgeable, especially about exotic destinations. Uh, that's unusual for Perillo tours. We go to the you know the the big uh, uh, famous uh, places like Italy and Hawaii. Uh, she's a specialist in India and Africa. India is an amazing uh, place. Uh, so the world is full of uh, amazing places. She uh, specializes in groups, uh, re really it's uh, groups with experiential travel, and she teaches you how to do that. Steve, thank you for talking to us. Thank you, Alan. Thank you very much. It's been a pleasure. And again, this is Alan Fine for Insider Travel Report.